approximations or the first term 14 second term 16 square means 256 what is the uh, 256 plus 14 270 minus 220 50 or not? next question number 58 what is the first term 13 second term 6 13 6 is 78 next uh, 7 into 9 square 81 7 into 81 567 567 plus 78 that will be 645 or not? which option second one next to 59 what is the first one 7 second one 4 7 4 the 28 next to 4 into 5 20 plus 12 total it is 60 or not? 20 plus 28 48 plus 12 60 next question number 60 11 square 121 plus 5 minus 9 or not? minus 9 right hand side negative becomes positive or the 8 square 64 uh, first of all 64 plus 5 69 minus 9 means 60 121 plus 60 181 next uh, what is the numerator 7 denominator 6 6 how many times 80 3 times 7 into 3 21 plus 33 what is the answer 54 next to 62 what is the 6 square 36 plus 9 into 14 9 into 14 126 plus 11 total it is 162 plus 11 173 number series completed next question number 69 69. The given data is regarding the number of students male plus female and out of the number of male plus female, the number of students male plus female with work experience are and here college A, what is the total strength are given? 240. And in that, the number of students male plus female with work experience is 96. Means out of 240, 96 are which one? Work, ex work experience are Suppose A total members is how much? 240. In that uh, work experience is how many members? 96. Work experience are 96. Obviously freshers are 144. Or 144. What is the note is given? Total number of students male plus female that is equal to number of students male plus female with work experience and number of students who are freshers are Okay, work experience 96 members, pressures are 144. What is the B total value? 280. In the 280, work experience are 84. Remaining 196. Next, in C, 320. In the 320, work experience are 160. Pressures also 160. Next, in D, 360. In that, work experience 162. What is the remaining? 198 or what is the question here first uh, before the 69 question uh, what is the question number 73 what is the respective ratio between the number of students male plus female who are freshers in college A and the total number of students male plus female who have work experience in college B and C together male plus female who are freshers in college A 144 male plus female who are freshers in college A how much 144 who have work experience in college B and C together work experience college B and C together means 84 plus 160 how much 244 one is 144 another one are 244 4 how many times 36 4 how many times 61 are what is the ratio 36 is to 61 are next 72 question what is the difference between the average number of students male plus female who are freshers in college A and C 
and the average number of students male plus female who have work experience in college b and d freshers in college a and c what are the freshers in college a 144 c 160 total 304 next uh, it is compared to work experience in college b and d what are the college b work experience 84 and d value 162 what are the together 246 and what is the difference between these two values 58 divided by 2 because required average difference or some difference average difference some difference means 304 minus 246 but average difference means divide by 2 what is the answer 29 next 71 question if the number of male if the number of male who are fresher students in college A are which one? 70. And number of male with work experience students in the same college are 48. 48. And uh, what is the total number of females who have work experience work experience plus who are in freshers in college A? First of all, the number of males who are fresher students in college A are how much? 70. In college A, total freshers are College year total freshers are 144. In that male members 70. Obviously remaining 74. Those are in which one? Female sir. Next. What is the next line is given? And the number of male with work experience students in the same college are which one? 48. Means out of 96. Male are how much? 48. Means female also? 48 are 40. Eight. What is the question here? What is the total number of females who have work experience plus who are in pressure, sir? Means one will be 48, another one are 74. What is the answer? 122. Next question number 70. If the number of female students who are in freshers in college D are which one? 98. Who are in freshers in college D are which one? 98 and the number of female students with work experience are 40 percentage of the number of male students who are in freshers in the same college what is the number of male students who have work experience in college dear first of all female students who are freshers in college d are which one 98 in college d total freshers are 198 in that female members are 98 are obviously male members Hundred or okay. What is the next line? Number of female students with work experience are forty percent of the number of male students who are in freshers in the same college. What are the freshers in college? Like? Male. Male students who are freshers in the same college. What are the college like freshers? Male freshers hundred. In that how much person? Forty percent. That forty percent are work experience. Female or male? Female means 40 members are which one? Female members with work experience or not? Means out of 162, 40 are female members means what are the remaining? 122. That 122 are which one? Male members or female members? Male members. What is the question here? What is the number of male students who have work experience in college? D. What is the answer? 122 or not? Next question number 69. The number of female students in college B who got free placement offer were 20 more than the number of male students in college B who got free placement offer. And if the number of males who appeared for the placement process was 30 percentage of the number of students in college B or not? College B. And how many female students got free placement offer? Total number of male students in college B is how much? 1500. Okay. First. Uh, what is the second note argument? Those who got the free placement offer were not allowed to a part of the placement. And remaining students were part of the placement processor. Placement process. And what is the last line is given? Total number of male students in college B is given how much? 105. What is the college B total strength? 200 
ADN in the 280 male and female. What are the male members? 105. Obviously female. 175. 175. And what is the starting line is given? The female students in college B who got pre-placement offer were 20 more than the which one? Male students in college B who got pre-placement offer. Pre-placement offer. Next line, if the number of males who appeared for the placement process was 30% of the number of students in college B. What is the college B total strength? 280. In the 30% are placement processor. Placement process. What is the second note is given? That those who got the free placement offer not allowed to a part of the placement and remaining students were part of the which one? Placement process. Means here 30% are which one? Placement processor. Means how much percent are selected already? 70% 70% of which one? 280 Out of total members 30% are placement process means remaining is how much? 70% What is the 70% of which one? 280 70% of 280 What is the 70% of 280? 196 That 196 are which one? Male Male Placement value or Male placement is how many members? 196. 196. And what is the condition here? The number of males who appeared for the placement process was 30% of the which one? College B or not? Out of 280, 70 only males are total. Only males who appeared for the placement process was 30% of the which one? Number of students in college B. What is the college B here? 280. In that 280, 30% are placement processor. Means how much percent are process is completed? 70% means 70% of 280 means that is how much? 196. That 196. And what is the starting line here? Female students in college B who got a free placement offer. 196 are which one? Free placement offer. And female students compared to 20 more than the which one? Male students in college B who got free placement offer. Already male members are how much? 196. That 196 are getting free placement offer. Compared to that one, how many members are more? 20 more. Means that will be 216. What is the question here? How many female students got free placement offer? What is the 30% of 280? 84. Means male how many members are got pre-placement? 84 are. What is the total males are there? 105. Out of 105, 84 got placement are. Means remaining 21 are. 21. कड़ो मिस्टेक जेस ट्वेंटी वन आठ फाइ एट वन आठ फाइ एटी फोर और डी डिफरेंस ट्वेंटी वन इट इज विच वन Male or not? Compared to this one, how many members are female more? 20 more. Means return 21 plus 20. What is the answer? 41. Number of males who appeared for the placement process was 30% of the students in college B. First out of, one, uh, out of 280, 30% means how much? 84. Out of 105, 84 members are placement process or not? Means how many members are free placement? 21 members are compared to 21. How many members are female more? 20 more are 
ट्वेंटी वन प्लस ट्वेंटी फोर्टी वन यर रिक्वायर्ड फीमेल वैल्यू और मेल वैल्यू फीमेल वैल्यू और द आंसर फोर्टी वन नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन नंबर सेवेंटी थ्री सॉरी सेवेंटी फोर इन कॉलेज सी थर्टी परसेंटेज ऑफ द नंबर ऑफ स्टूडेंट्स मेल प्लस फीमेल टू हैव वर्क एक्सपीरियंस गॉट प्लेसड ऑन डे वन ऑफ द प्लेसमेंट प्रोसेस and 50 percent of the number of students male plus female who are freshers also got placed on day one what is the ratio between the number of students male plus female who have work experience and got placed on day one and the number of students male plus female who are freshers and got placed on day one which college here college here college c in college c work experience candidate how much percent are on day one Thirty percent. Or the college C work experience one one sixty means thirty percent of which one one sixty are forty eight are next up uh, uh, in freshers how much percent are there fifty percent. Or the freshers here one sixty are means written fifty percent of one sixty are both sides one sixty one sixty cancel are. Or the ratio three is to five. 